big boy version of the Smoke Nord 19 kit we looked at last week. So this is going to have more juice capacity, bigger battery, maybe bigger vapes. We're going to find out right after this. So that's right guys, I am back. Should be welcoming myself back to the channel as well because I know the videos have been kind of scarce over the last month, but I have great news. Yesterday, we actually got my father moved into his brand new, beautiful assisted living facility in old downtown Ballard. So anybody who's familiar with Seattle knows that is a very nice area. Great place. It is wonderful to have them at a rehabilitation center from going from basically a hospital setting where you're sharing a room with another person, you know, most likely terminally ill, elderly person. You know, he had a few of them come and go while he was in there. And now to be in his own apartment, basically having just wonderful services and everything provided. It was a huge ordeal to go from where he broke his hip a month ago to get to the point now where he's back living independently and everything but it was well worth it. So I'm a little worn out from everything, been going back and forth, back and forth from here to Seattle. It's about a three hour trip each way. So I'm worn out, but I'll tell you the truth, I couldn't be happier than to be here with you guys today doing what I love, checking out a new product and helping some of you guys get off them damn icky sticks. So let's see what Smoke has brought us today in the form of their brand new Nord. Now this is the new, basically the Smoke Nord Stick, I would call it, because it is a stick mod. It's gonna come with just what you see here. You got your two coils, there's not one pre-installed, so two coils is what you get. You have your micro USB charger, the battery, and your tank all in one unit here. It is basically an AIO all in one. No, I'm not singing old McDonald's. It says Vape Pen Nord right there, and then on the front it says Smoke, but very nice looking vape pen, maybe one of the best I've seen. The 22 comes with a 2000 mAh built-in battery. I believe the 19 had around a 1300 mAh, and then instead of a 2 mil tank, you got a 3.6 mil tank up here. Otherwise, the device is going to work fairly similarly. You have the one button action right up here. Let's go ahead. Turn the unit on to start with. There you go. Now you know you're active. That will light up when you fire it. Two clicks will tell you your battery um, life on that. To fill the unit up, you have this kind of unique screw off drip tip and then two big slots. Nice and slotty, just the way I like them. Oh, and then we need to get some juice for this. And we're just about at the end of the month, but it works out because we got just that much left of my sample box. Hot damn! I got a little bit of that strawberry gummies left from 1UP, and I do love all of the fruity flavors I've tried from 1UP. They're absolutely delicious. This strawberry gummy being no exception. Sample box is an e-juice of the month club. So it's basically just like a wine of the, what the? Oh, I forgot to put in a fucking coil. All right, guys, so that's a demonstration of what not to do. Always make sure you put that coil in. I'm just kidding. That was actually one of the stupider things I have done in a while, but actually maybe not. Not if you count scraping up the side of my Dodge Charger in the rehab parking lot over there in Seattle, the crazy-ass little windy driveway. People parked on both sides. Ambulance is coming and going. I knew if I was going in and out of there enough times, it would happen eventually. But luckily I got progressive accident forgiveness. I'm good to go, 500 bucks fixing me up like new. But I was not happy on the day. All right guys, this is what you're gonna wanna do. Let's go ahead and take a look at the coils. So, this is the 1.4 mouth to lung coil that they put in there. That's great for beginners, people just getting off the icky sticks. Then if you wanna upgrade, they include a 0.6 direct lung hit coil that we're gonna be using today. So I think that's awesome. They kind of give people that range, so it's not like you need to go out and buy a new device right off the bat. You can just switch the coils out when you're ready to start getting the big clouds. A super easy to put your coil in, plug and play method, slides right in, and now it ain't gonna leak no more. And yes, sample box is an e-juice of the month club. So you basically fill out a form with your flavor um, preferences and what you like and what you don't like, and then they customize a box for you. They send it to your front door 60% off retail price. So it's a great deal. Hang out to the end of this video if you guys wanna find out how you can sign up for a sample box subscription for yourself all right ding 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 we did it we got a full tank here with the 
0.6 resistance coil. We are already powered up and ready to go. And like I said, two pushes will give you your battery charge, which is like yellow right now. I'm a little surprised. Usually right out the box, Smoke's products are always fully charged. But you should always charge any new devices, vapes, before you use them. Give them a full charge. But of course, like I said, that's what you're supposed to do. Me, I crack them out the box and vape. But I'm the exception that proves the rule. Kind of like Trump. All right, let's see how this thing vapes. We got plenty of power to get some good hits off of this. Here we go, the Smoke Nord 22 Vape Pen. Woo, holy cock moly Batman. That was some pretty damn good vapor. I think the airflow, the holes are a little bit bigger on this. So if you are looking or thinking you're going to be stepping up to doing the sub-ohm vapes, like that 0.6 coil I'm using on here too, then keep that in mind. You're going to have a little bit bigger airflow, I think, on the 22. Hells yeah! That was the eight second cutoff. So that's basically about the most vapor production you're gonna be able to get off of this thing. I'm gonna scoop back so I can kind of give you one. You can see the actual cloud itself. Flavor is a pop in. These are mesh coils and that strawberry gummy man from One Up. If you like a sweet candy fruit flavor, hells yeah, that is one of the best. There you guys.